singles match number two underway. A Red Alliance with the advantage in our best of three series. A Red Alliance wins means we have a regional champion. A Blue Alliance win forces a tiebreaker match in the finals. Both our Red and Blue Alliances with very impressive autonomous periods. Blue Alliance able to score eight cargo in the upper hub, six cargo for Red. We are neck and neck going into our teleoperated period. A Blue Alliance with a two point advantage. And just like we saw last match, some aggressive defense being played to slow down some of our most effective robots. Robotic Eagles playing defense for the Red Alliance. Eagle Army playing defense for Blue. This means the bulk of the Red Alliance scoring being done by Wild Stang and Gear It Forward, where the bulk of the Blue Alliance scoring being done by Ponage and Hilltoppers. A minute and a half remaining, Blue Alliance building a lead, and they need that lead. Eagle Army hitting and pushing Gear It Forward. They back off just in time. Gear It Forward got very close to the Red Alliance launch pad. If there was contact while Gear It Forward was in that launch pad, that would be a foul. Contact with an Alliance launch pad provides a safety zone for a robot. Gear It Forward, two beautiful shots for four points. Ponich tries to do the same, makes one and misses the other. Less than a minute to go. Blue Alliance still in the lead, 80 to 74. An impressive 31 scored cargo in the upper hub for Blue, 28 for Red, thanks to the efforts of Wildstag and Gear It Forward. That whistle means 30 seconds remaining in the match. A lot of action near the Blue Alliance hangar. Robotic Eagles in a dangerous position in the final 30 seconds of the match. They get away from that Blue Alliance hangar. A very important move. That hangar is a safe zone during these final 30 seconds. Less than 10 seconds to go. Wild State trying to get a traversal run climb. Geared forward does it. 30 points in the hangar for Red.